So first thing in the morning, I'll feed Spike his breakfast because if I don't, he'll probably come murder me in the bathroom while I'm trying to get ready for the day. I do feed him a mixed wet and dry food diet to help him stay hydrated, and I just follow Royal Cannon's serving size on the back of their kibble bag. Currently, he is almost six months old, so I feed him half a three ounce can of wet food and a fourth cup of dry kibble every morning. So normally while he's eating, I'll then go over and clean his litter box so that he's distracted and won't come and try to play with his poop while I'm doing this. If you're wondering why the heck I'm using a steam pan as a litter box, someone on Reddit who worked at a shelter actually recommended this because it helps reduce odors and the stainless steel is very easy to clean. I did link the one that I got below on Amazon. If you're interested in trying it out, I do highly recommend it. We did train Spike to sleep throughout the entire night, so normally after breakfast, he's wide awake and ready to play. Thankfully now I'm working from home because of the pandemic, so I do have time to play with him for about 30 to 40 minutes before I sit down and get some work done. After our play session, I do like to give him a little treat. I also try to train him, but for the sake of filming today, I kind of just let him enjoy it. Normally around 11 to 12, Spike will start to settle down and he'll just find a safe place to rest and groom himself up for his afternoon nap. And then really, he'll mostly just sleep throughout the entire afternoon. I mean, he'll wake up here and there, but mostly it's just him shifting from the couch to his tower to the couch again. I do have a really janky portable workstation that I set up right next to his favorite spot on the couch, so he'll eventually come over at some point and uh, punch some random letters onto my document and then settle down for another nap next to me. I also try to groom him at least one to two times per day to keep his coat healthy. This happens really whenever he's around me and I have time to reach over and brush him a bit. So if he's next to me like today, I'll grab the brush, give him a quick groom, and then he'll likely fall asleep until dinner time. Around 5 p.m. is when he'll start to meow for his dinner. So again, just the same as breakfast, I'll give him the other half of the canned wet food and then another one fourth cup of kibble. I do put the dry food in a separate bowl because he will inhale the wet food right away and then he'll ration out the kibble throughout the rest of the evening. So three times a week I try to brush his teeth after dinner. He is growing in his adult teeth which makes his breath stink really bad. So for the sake of his breath and just for long term oral health, I'm trying to make this more of a habit now. Didn't even bother trying to get clean footage of him actually getting his teeth brushed because he's so fussy. But this is him afterwards, he usually just grooms again and then really for the rest of the evening he's just off doing cat things. I also try to get one more play session in before bed because that way he'll actually sleep throughout the entire night and he won't wake us up. So that is pretty much my entire daily care routine with my new kitten Spike. I hope that this was helpful for people who are also considering getting a kitten during this time. Please feel free to leave any questions or comments down below and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching!